Hi everyone. Unfortunately, it's time for the Parker family to say a big goodbye to Erinsborough. So we'd like to say a personal goodbye to you. Well, we leave um, because of a series of very catastrophic events. Unfortunately, we have a car accident. While I'm singing 10 green bottles, <laughs> I uh, You're zig. You're not concentrating. I'm not, and I zig when I should have zagged. <laughs> and uh, we go over this embankment and have a disastrous car accident. And it's un unclear whether we're going to survive. But um, One of us doesn't. One of us doesn't. Yeah, and, um, and... And then it's just too catastrophic for us, isn't it? We, mm. can't, we can't cope with our grief. We so can't deal with with being back at Ramsey Street because it's just memories. too many memories in number 26. <laughs> so we decide to pack up our bags and go back to Merry Oakey. There is a place called Oakey in Queensland where it's full of old neighbours characters. Yeah, and we're actually thinking of doing a <laughs> spin-off, you know. <laughs> yeah, the Parkers at home on the phone. Well, neighbours in, in Oakey. <laughs> Customarily on Neighbours, your last scene involves a neck brace. Yeah. It felt like being on a movie set because... You know, we were shooting a lot of the time two cameras, sometimes three cameras. There was some action stuff. There was big sweeping overhead shots with the cherry picker. So in terms of production value, it looked like a really, you know, an expensive film set day, you know. And it felt like that too. There's a certain sadness. Uh, and also we are filming very emotional scenes where you have to go to places where obviously you don't really want to have to go. Um, like Oki. <laughs> Well, emotional places. Yeah, emotional places. Working on a, a soap like Neighbours is, is very challenging because you've got so many storylines you're working with at any given time. Like, we work on ten up to ten episodes in any given week, and they're not filmed in order. So <laughs> it's, it's very challenging from that perspective. And also the sheer volume of work. You know, it's not uncommon for us to pull 12-hour days, sometimes two, three days in a row. And it's quite relentless. When when the when you've got a heavy storyline, it takes up your whole life. To give you an idea, on Matrix Reloaded, we were filming two minutes a day. <laughs> on this, we shoot half an hour a day. We shoot a whole episode we a shoot, day, yeah. which is yeah, extremely fast. Some of the funniest things that happened on set, we're not allowed to talk about, obviously. <laughs> but um, oh, there was a pretty good one with um, Alan Fletcher in the hospital <gasps> sequence when we're filming this incredibly urgent, sort of really high drama, tense thing where... <laughs> where um, we're all in the hospital waiting to rush into a room to hear the results of a particular test. Are they alive? Are they dead? <laughs> the director goes, <laughs> and action, and there's this silence. And we sort of look over, and Alan, who's, who had, been, had a late night the night before um, working... He'll uh, kill you for this. <laughs> he, he just... He, you hear this... And there's Alan fall, he's falling asleep in the in the actual waiting room of the hospital. Boom, boom, boom. It would blow my mind. Yeah. <laughs> Purple Turtles, Manly Vale Pub, final year. Yeah, 1984. When you, when you work on Neighbours, it really becomes your life. And you really do become part of a big family. And, you know, I mean, my birth of my son, you know, has happened during this... Um, I got married during the show. <laughs> you know, there's a lot of sort of landmarks in my life that have happened during the filming of the show, which, which I'll remember forever. You know, and and I've made some good friends, and you know, I think I'm gonna, I'm gonna. Neighbours will always be a part of my life, whether I like it or not. You know. <laughs> Thanks for tuning in each weeknight at 6.30 and logging on to the Neighbours website. It's been fantastic. We'll really miss you.